On This Spot, New York City, Stories of Pioneering Women Artists. Guerrilla Girls at the Palladium. The revolution had begun. On October 17, 1985, the Guerrilla Girls mounted a sprawling exhibition of women artists at the Palladium Nightclub at 126 East 14th Street on the edge of the East Village. A call to arms, it featured an amazing roster of 100 well-known and emerging names. Included were Louise Bourgeois, Jane Dixon, Jenny Holzer, Louise Lawler, Lady Pink, Howardina Pindell, Faith Ringel, Cindy Sherman, Kiki Smith, and Karen Finley. They called it The Night the Palladium Apologized. It was their first exhibition. The poster said, exhibition curated by Guerrilla Girls, the Women Artist Terrorist Organization. Who were the Guerrilla Girls? They were, and still are, an anonymous group of female artists who are devoted to fighting sexism and racial inequality in the art world. They formed in the spring of 1985. Seven women launching a collective to protest a Museum of Modern Art survey show of almost entirely male artists. They organized marches and made posters. Their infamous street poster campaign changed everything. Scathing and sarcastic, the posters used statistics, irrefutable facts and figures. These were wheat pasted to walls, phone booths, and galleries all over Lower Manhattan, especially in Soho and the East Village. Now, their posters from the 1980s are in major museum collections. Today, Guerrilla Girls stage lectures and protests, create billboards and wall projections, and continue to spread their righteous message. They famously asked, do women have to be naked to get into the Met Museum? 30 years later, we are still asking the question. It took guerrilla warfare to make it happen.